Hey guys, Real McCoy 411. Welcome back to my channel. We are going to be doing a twist again, a twist out. Yes, a twist out. Um, I'm experiencing some flakes in my hair. We're going to use the Aunt ja Jackie's line and we're going to go in with her shampoo, also clean, and the quench leave in conditioner. Now, I'm also going to add some of my rice water as a leave-in. And then we're going to go in with the curl -a la And we're going to use an oil, Blue Magic Castor Oil, to seal it off. So, you guys get ready. I'm going to jump in the shower. No, I'm going to get in the shower because if I jump in the shower, I'll hurt myself. I got it. So, I'm going to get in the shower, really take care of my hair, put in my leave-ins. All that kind of stuff let my hair dry some bow dry my hair a little bit because I want to do these twists on just damp hair okay get ready all right guys I'm back look I cannot tell you how much my hair has missed my rice water this is my rice water leave-in conditioner and i add it directly to my scalp okay the uh on jackies and the other leave-in conditions i add to my hair strands but i could tell the difference in me doing my hair over the past couple months of my hair is just different and when I use my rice water the way it makes my scalp feel and my hair actually grows a little bit more it does help with growth I'm sorry I'm, I'm not going to sit here and lie to you and tell you it don't it helps with growth and I noticed that my growth had stopped now it could be because of split ends it could be because of this it could be because of that but all I can tell you is that when I was using the rice water my hair was growing okay so the rice water is in my hair the unjack is quenched leave-in is on my hair strands I'm about to blow dry my hair uh, just to take some of the wetness out and <coughs> not using a fancy smancy blow dry I'm just using what I got on hand <coughs> excuse me whoa okay um, I'm gonna put this on High speed, medium heat. All right, let's get it. Okay, so my hair is damp now as it is not completely dry, just damp. And that's what I wanted. And I wanted to use that heat a little of that heat to put in make sure that leave-in gets in there real good make sure my rice water gets onto my scalp and everything real good so now we're just going to prep our hair to twist guys i i'm just so excited that i feel like i finally got this twist down do you hear me and and you all saw it when i started um when i started the video i still had definition and everything but I had flakes from the um, the jelly, the curling jelly from the As I Am. And that could be because I didn't go in and, excuse me, I didn't go in and put my oil in like I should have afterwards. I, I, I'm not, I'm not for sure. I don't, I don't know why. I don't know why, but it, it was flaking. And I'm not really a jelly or gel type person anyway. So I should have, you know, just stuck with the double butter cream and, and called it a day. But I didn't. I had to add some jelly. So um, am I going to use the jelly again? Yeah, I'm going to use it for a wash and go with an oil. With an oil. So that I can tell you for sure so leave-in is already in hair hair is detangled 
The only thing left for us to do is to add out Aunt Jackie's Curl A La and add the Blue Magic to seal in all of this lusciousness that I got going on right now. Because my head is feeling really good. My hair strands are feeling good. Um, I slept on my rice water for a whole month, y'all. I didn't, I haven't used my rice water in about a month or a month and a half, probably. And there's a difference. That's all I can tell you. There's a difference. There is a difference. So let me open up my products, which I should have had already open. But hey, come on. This is TV, man. This is YouTube. Okay. So I have this section of my hair. I'm going to go ahead and get this. Now, this is a custard-like feeling. It's creamy, but it's also custard-like. Let me make see. Actually, it's Define Curl Custard. Exactly. So it's a custard-like feeling. Now, I'm going to have more blue magic on my hair probably than the custard right blue magic is good for hair growth blue magic works great for sealing and i'm a greasy natural i i use hair grease i haven't even used my hair grease in a while so i i gotta get back on on what i was doing i gotta get back to what i was doing it's okay to try other products and everything, but if you got some staples, staples that you know are working, don't don't shy away from them. Do not shy away from your products that you know got your hair working. That's working good for your hair. Okay? So, here is the and I use the, I'm choosing the 100% pure castor oil, shea butter, and aloe vera. This is the blue magic that I'm using. So I'm going to take that blue magic. And I'm going to add it to this section of my hair. You know, I understand about not using products that are damaging to your hair okay you know that's understandable but as far as hair grease if you use oils you can use hair grease that's that's all I'm gonna say about that I ain't gonna say nothing else I ain't gonna say nothing else so here are my first two juicy twists. Let's speed up the video. Remember the curl a la is already in my hair. The only thing I'm gonna be adding to these parts is my blue magic. Let's get it.
so my twists are complete in the front in the back my hair is damp it's just damp but I was able to get some good juicy twists some good moisturized twists the blue magic really seals the deal it really does so I have every type of blue magic hair grease they got I have the blue magic leave-in conditioners I'm gonna go back to that on my regimen I'm still going to be using these products and that's and, and there's nothing wrong with using the products and there's nothing wrong with using the products oils or the products um, leave-ins is nothing wrong with that I'm not straying away from that but I am going to add back in my blue magic and my rice water so if there is a leave-in then that leave-in will probably be used with my rice water if there is an oil then I, I may not be using that oil I may just be using the blue magic or the wild growth oil I use that which some of these oils are already in my rice water like wild growth oil is in my rice water vitamin D oil there are a lot of oils and everything in my rice water and I gave out the ingredients to my rice water once before in one of my videos prior to this one um, and it just has all types of nutritious stuff in there along with fermented rice five-day fermented rice and it smells luscious not luscious luscious yes because I used a leave-in in here one of the leave-ins in here is from the blue magic line and it's the carrot oil one and oh my goodness so I will see you guys at the takedown honestly uh, tomorrow's the off day so it may just be tomorrow if I decide to go anywhere but these twists are good locked in and just ready for me to relax so but look at the growth y'all look at the growth my hair has grown so much and I want to keep it going because I got goals for 2020 my first goal for 2019 was to have some hair touching my shoulder and have healthy hair. I've achieved both of those. So my goals for 2020 is to make my hair even more healthier and even more longer. Okay? And for me to learn more and more about my hair. More and more about my hair. What my hair likes. So I will see you guys at the takedown where I will be using this little handy dandy pick that I like and I will be separating my twists accordingly so there's no gel on my hair there's no gel so my sealant was the blue magic I'm hoping my turn my twist out turns out the same way because I used a curling jelly and that turned out really good but it flaked up on me and I don't do flakes I don't do flakes so we'll see we'll see I'll see y'all at the takedown hey guys Remacore 411 welcome back welcome back to the takedown now I'm gonna go in with some wild growth oil finish hitting up my parts here Now, wild growth oil was and is in my rice water leave-in because my main purpose of the rice water leave-in is for to retain length and to grow my hair. Mm. Rice water don't grow your hair. Your hair grows a half an inch to an inch every month. Yeah, that's true, but... I noticed a couple more inches, a couple more inches when I was using my rice water. So, mm, I don't know what your statistics say, but I know what mine say. Mine say there's a chance, there's a chance, there's a chance. Okay, 
Now we're going to put some of this wild growth oil on our hands and begin to do the takedown of these twists that are fully dry, air dried overnight. Mega. using curl la la and blue magic hair grease no gel so I shouldn't see any flaking on this one if I see some flaking on this one the universe is trying to tell me something now I don't believe in the universe Jesus is trying to tell me something but I have to do these protective hairstyles right now because it's cold in Texas check your weather check your weather but it's going to be in the 70s this weekend. So, I think I may go back in. No, no, no. I have a wash and go product that I'm going to try to go back in. And I'm going to do another wash and go. But I have a specific product that I'm going to use for a wash and go this weekend. So, I hope you guys have enjoyed the video. You see, I put the little combs up on the side. <sighs> Just to add something to it. Not 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 a good fluffer, but hey, this is it. This is the takedown. Little frizz, but not much. Mostly just took it took my twists and took them apart. That's what I did. Show me what you did. Baby, that's what I did. I just made that song up. No copyrights. Look at that definition. Yeah. Oh yeah. That one can be taken apart a little bit. Always just separate where it will allow you to separate. It'll get fuller and fuller. But what I do at nighttime is I take a chunk and I braid it up or twist it up. Braid it up, twist it up, next day take it down, and it's actually going to be fuller. So, I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. If you're new, go ahead and click on the subscribe button. Um, and also click on the notification bell. Join me on my natural hair journey where I am learning the do's and the don'ts. So that you will not have to do the don'ts. But, I keep it healthy. I'm not putting anything on my hair that I think that is going to harm my hair in any type of way. So every product that I use has something in it that I feel that will help improve my hair strands. Okay? Alright? Keep God first in everything you do. And I do mean everything. And I will see y'all in the next video. Bye.